Hi, I'm Charles Cornrault, and you probably know me from the TV show Tuesday Afternoon. Well, enough about me. Join my fellow celebrities as we take a look at small town living at its best. Located in Sarcoxie, Missouri, in Jasper County, you'll find Cimarron Antiques. In 2002, Bill and Judy Clement were involved in two careers. Judy was in banking, and Bill owned and ran an RV park. They really weren't thinking of another job when the opportunity came to purchase a 1960s brick service station and about two and a half acres at a good price. It was right on Interstate 44 at an exceptional exit location just about a quarter mile from the RV park. At the time, they were both 61 years of age and saw this as a good retirement project. They had the idea of opening a small antique store and a museum for Native American artifacts that Bill had been collecting for some time. They laid out the cash and began to remodel and add on to the building. They already owned five acres just across the lane east of the property, so their purchase of the service station made even more sense. The building project was completed in the summer of 2003 and opened July 31st. After a couple of add-ons, the building now is over 10,000 square feet and is jammed floor to ceiling with all sorts of treasures, literally. There is stuff hanging from the vaulted ceiling. Plus, most of the two and a half acres outside is piled high with primitives. In 2007, the Clements had built a barn on their residential property and filled it full of furniture and treasures, including a huge chandelier that had hung in the historic Connor Hotel in Joplin, large pieces of art, over 50 sewing machines, 5,000 plus vinyl LPs, crates of military surplus, and all sorts of furniture. Sadly, in June of 2008, a fire destroyed the barn and all of its wonderful and treasured pieces. That was also the year that Judy retired from banking, and in 2010, the RV park was sold so that both Bill and Judy could devote their full attention to their addictive retirement project, which grew and grew. In 2013, the couple had the opportunity to purchase another building on the other side of I-44 at the same exit. This building was originally a craft mall and tea room, but through the years had been used as restaurants and bars. And Cimarron's inventory had far outgrown the original building, so the purchase of another 13,000 square foot building was a no-brainer. And this one came with over six acres and was just across the road from their residence and furniture warehouse. Bill added on an annex on one end of the building and a pole barn type addition on the other. And that building is now filled with even more stuff and the land has been used for larger items such as horse-drawn farm equipment, concrete yard fixtures, railroad ties, telephone poles, metal wheels, and more. Check them out on Facebook for an at-home peek at the wonderland of treasures that await you at Cimarron Antiques. Bill and Judy look forward to meeting you and invite you to stop in soon. Cimarron Antiques. Sarcoxy, Missouri.